would it be the end of the world if we had a premier that actually knew a thing or two about housing? I don't know. I'm thinking it might not be such a bad thing. Uh, look, the fact of the matter is I worked on the capital side of the business, not the development side anyhow. But the, the reality is this. Um, let's look at the housing program of, under the current government, totally objectively. They were elected in 2017. They introduced a whole new blizzard of taxes onto housing. They said that that was, they said the housing problem was because uh, of evil developers and foreign buyers, okay? So they added all these new taxes and said that that's how they were going to get to affordable housing. Well, let's do a gut check. They're in their second term now, almost six years into it, and we've ended up with the highest housing prices in North America. That's not a good outcome. And, you know, it took them like year five before David Eby, while he was housing minister, finally acknowledged that maybe lack of supply might have something to do with the housing problem. Well, no kidding. I mean, like, I'm sorry, but it, I think it would be really good if we had somebody that did understand the housing business.